night, ja YouTube fucked up. I'm so used to saying Jagex fucked up, but it was actually YouTube. From about, I believe, 8 EST to whatever time, I don't know. I woke up this morning and I had gained zero fucking subscribers from last evening. Reason being is because there was a glitch on YouTube that you could not subscribe to any fucking channel. Any channel. So nobody could subscribe to you and you could no, you know, you couldn't subscribe to anyone. It's kind of fucked up. Yeah. Normally it's Jagex always fucking us, but now YouTube decides to fuck us soon. YouTube won't allow us to upload videos anymore. They will only allow us to upload pictures, which is going to be kind of difficult for me to upload like 25,000 fucking frames for a video. That would suck. Anyways, okay. Last night, I uploaded a new video to main channel, then plus I have new video fucking rendering on my little laptop over here. Do, 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 do. So, I got, it's a fucking uh, Q&A. You know, the questions, answers is the answer part. To my 300th video, I did a Q&A. Basically, you guys asked me questions. So, that video is boop, uploading. Um, not fucking uploading, rendering. Should be out sometime soon. It was just a uh, fairly big file, so it's fucking rendering. Uh, otherwise, I have a new video on my real life channel about hacking yourself and your own RuneScape account. That might kind of... That might... <laughs> fuck. That sound kind of... That, what the fuck is wrong with me? I'm going to bitch slap this, the shit out of myself in a minute. That might sound kind of messed up that you could hack your own RuneScape account, but you guys should check out the video. Anyways, as for tonight, I'm going to be 96 Dungeoneering. Reason being is because I'm going to be doing uh, two larges, and then I'm pretty much done with just about a lot of small. I only got like maybe 10 smalls left. Uh, I did quite a few smalls last night. I died uh, like a few times. Kind of sucks, but shit happens and life goes on. Oh well, Mike. Anyways, um, but I'll be 96 tonight. Uh, then farming. <laughs> like I said, probably won't be farming for a while, and that's pretty much about it. Just really want to get 96 tonight, and then that's pretty much all. Uh, moving on now. Alright guys, but one of you happy motherfuckers wants to know an interesting question. So we're going to dissect and discuss this question. And the motherfucker's username is all jacked up. So I'll just call this person Man. <laughs> so Mr. Man, if any of you guys have ever seen the movie Misery, then you know what I'm talking about. Mr. Man wants to know, is it worth getting 120 Dungeoneering, or is 99 just good enough? Pretty much. Um, okay. My personal opinion is that 120 is really not worth it. Okay, now the cape is fucking amazing, and that's the only reason why you would get the cape. But here's the catch. If you're playing in low detail, the cape does not fade away. If you guys have never seen a dungeon, a 120 cape before, um... The tail of the cape, or the end of the cape, is basically... If you guys ever light a piece of paper on fire, you know when you start, you light on fire, then you blow out the fire, and the paper will still crumble, and it will cause some smoke? That's basically what the cape is kind of like. There is no flame, but it looks like the cape is kind of crumbling on the bottom. Kind of like a fire cape, but not really. And then there's smoke coming out of the cape. It looks pretty fucking awesome. If you're in high detail, there's the catch. Now, getting a 120, that's the only reason why someone would do that. Or somebody wants to be max, max on RuneScape. Like a friend of mine, he's uh, two, uh, 399s away from being completely done with every skill. And I asked him, will you be getting 120 Dungeoneering? And he said very loudly, and it hurt my fucking ears, fuck no. So, therefore, yeah. <laughs> but... 120, the only thing that is good about it is getting the cape. And if you ask most 120 dungeon errors, what did you spend your tokens on? They will say EXP. Um, in my opinion, that's fucking stupid. But I understand because if you do have a lot of tokens, you could spend it on a lot of experience. Which, you know, it may help along the way. Because 120 is 104 mil EXP. So that's 10... 
So then that will be about fucking uh, 10 mil EXP you can buy in tokens. That's actually a lot of fucking EXP, but is it really worth it? I don't think so. I would rather have a shit ton of fucking chaotic mauls, long swords, rape bitch, rape rapiers, <laughs> than EXP. Um, so my my you know opinion is not worth it. One uh, getting 99 is pretty much fine. Once I get to 99, I'll have actually I think I'll have like 300k tokens because I'm going to fully upgrade my gatherer's ring. If you guys don't know what rings are, you can customize your Dungeoneering ring you Dungeoneer with to give you more strength bonus or to give you, um, like mine is gatherers. So whenever I fish or mine shit, I get a lot more than the average motherfucker. Like for example, last night I mined a ore and the average person may only get tops five. I got fucking 12 pieces. Yeah. So, having me in a dungeon to make armor is very fucking useful because of my ring. So, I'll probably most likely be able to buy one chaotic weapons if it's an emergency. But, if you want more tokens, you might as well just go to maybe 12 mil EXP. That's the only reason you may level up. Or, to get to 120, you want the total level plus the 120 cape. That's the only reason why I think that people get to 120. Otherwise... People get to 99 because they want chaotic weapons. They want fucking other shit. So, in my opinion, it's not worth it. And trust me when I say this, I will never get 120. Otherwise, I might not be alive. Alright guys, well like I said, if any of you guys can do, I believe I'm going to be doing floor fucking 38 large. Uh, then I want to do, I want to say 44 to 48 for the last, because, um, that's a big bulk of, uh, sorry, uh, that tasted kind of nasty going back down, anyways, it always fucking happens on vlog, never after vlog, <laughs> I don't know why, uh, why I say that for the big chunk at the ending, um, because I will probably get close to 500k experience just from those fucking floors, so, I gotta do 38, I believe, uh, 40 or 41, and then I gotta do like uh, 31, and then I just gotta do some more smalls and a few mediums. So, if you guys can do floors, then you're more than welcome to come if I have a bit, uh, availability on the team. Um, otherwise, yeah. Eh, that's about it. Going to be 96, which is going to be pretty fucking awesome. Anyways, right around, uh, right now, I'm going to go my email address and we have some happy hooba hooba questions. Ask them at yahoo.com and do not drink to me, use. Otherwise, you start burping uncontrollably. First, Hoopa Hoopa question. Ah, hi, Nightmare H. I just wanted to know why you use ultimate strength when you PK instead of Piety because it's better. Piety increases your defense by 25. Strength, 23. Attack, 20. And, and ultimate strength only gives you 15. Strength bonus. R is username. This is actually fairly interesting. 1999 through 2012. Uh, were you born in the year 1999, or do you just mean RuneScape? Hopefully fucking RuneScape, but you never know. Anyways, because I haven't done fucking King's Ransom, and no, I will not do King's Ransom, because I have to do seven quests to do fucking King's Ransom. It's bullshit. Yeah, it's bullshit. So, next question. Hey, Nightmare RH, I'm currently level 68 farming, and I would like to know what I should do for my herb runs. RS username, Made in Heaven. That's actually a fairly cool username. I actually like that. Alright, um, what type of herb you should do? Do the highest amount of fucking herb you can do, but make sure you're making money. If you're not making money, don't do the herb. Listen, it's very simple. You open whatever type of web browser you use, go to fucking RuneScape homepage, then go to the Grand Exchange, then look. Just see what herb makes you good money. It's pretty simple. Or if you want EXP, then it's not really about money, it's primarily about fucking EXP. Oh well. But anyways, guys, if you got anything for me, you can leave me a nasty dear little comment. I'll be dung fung bung a fucking nairing tonight. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. Take care, happy RuneScaping, and check out my new RuneScape video. Bye!